Welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you guys a Michaels haul. I went into Michaels just to see what all I could find. I was of course looking for kind of my last of my Halloween stuff and I was kind of disappointed because my Michaels was really wiped out of a lot of things but I will show you guys what I did find. Their Halloween stuff is 50% off today and I also had a 20% off coupon so I used that as well. I'll let you know what my total was that I spent there at the end and what it would have been without those coupons. So most of my items are Halloween, but I did buy a few things that are not Halloween. So let's just get right into it. The first thing I bought and I was really going in looking for, you know, like some crafty stuff, but I was kind of disappointed, but I did find this stuff. And before I show it to you, I know what you're thinking. You can get that at Dollar Tree for a dollar but you can't get it in a package this big and you can't get it in these colors already mixed together. So I went ahead and bought some of this. I don't even know what they call it. Uh, they, it just, oh, just paper shred. So I went ahead and bought some of this. Um, it is by Celebrate It and it says Halloween and it was originally $4. So today it was only $2 and then it was 20% more off of that. And the only reason I convinced myself to buy it is because I love the colors one. I like to put this in my Happy Meal packages when I send them. And I mean, comparatively, here's a package from Dollar Tree. Here's the package from Michaels. So you can kind of see the difference in them. So for $2 and then another 20% off of that, I feel like you're kind of getting two packages worth. So I went ahead and convinced myself to buy this um, because I thought it was... I thought it was a pretty good deal. So paid $2 for that plus 20% more off that. I couldn't hardly find any Halloween sticker stacks at all. They were all the single ones and I just can't justify paying like $2 for nine stickers. It just, I can't do it. I'm too much of a cheapo. But I was at the checkout line and somebody had, I guess just set this off to the side and it was originally only a dollar fifty and it was half off of that so i only paid 75 cents for this sticker pack it has some really cute stuff it says witch and <laughs> witch and famous that's funny i hadn't even read it yet it says witch and famous and you can see right there sorry about the glare these are some of the there's that like the theme of it but it just had some really cute stuff i like the cute witches and the cats there that is so cute she's like bathing in a cauldron and there's the other one and then it just starts repeating so i thought these were super cute i'll definitely use them um you can't ever have too many stickers even though i probably do but <laughs> Um, so yeah, and for 75 cents, I wasn't going to leave it at the store, so I bought it. These next items I bought, I was pretty excited about these because I had actually been looking for these before now. I actually don't need them anymore for what I had originally wanted them for, but they were with the little section that has like experimental, I don't even know what you would call it, like potion stuff. Um, but yeah, so it just says that it's a Halloween test tube. I thought that it would be really good to put like little embellishments and stuff that I want to use just as a holder, just as a storage container. So I bought two of those and it was originally $1.99. So I only paid a dollar for it plus an extra 20% off. These were so, so cute. I could not pass these up it says that they are halloween scratch and sniff and i didn't actually smell of them in the store so let me see here oh my gosh they do they smell <laughs> that's crazy they smell just like pumpkin spice so there was i went ahead and bought these one because they're super cute but back on my rant about not being able to pay for like nine stickers these were $4.99 originally, as you can see right here, but they were half of that. So I paid $2.50 plus an extra 20% off. 
but there are 36 stickers in here. So it's not like it's just this one page. There is more than one page in there. So really excited. Hey, I just realized that somebody took a sticker out of it. That is so funny. That's hilarious. They probably just like wanted that one, whatever. But yeah, I thought those were really, really cute. And some of them aren't just Halloween. Like this one and this one, you could use those for fall. They're not really Halloween centered. So that is so fun. And it's even more fun that they're scratch and stiff. Stiff, scratch and stiff, scratch and sniff. Super cute. Last year after Halloween, I bought a bunch of washi tape from Michaels and like a lot, a lot of washi tape, including Martha Stewart. But this year they were pretty much wiped out. I didn't see any paper packs. I didn't see any washi tape besides this type. So I don't know. I don't know if they just didn't reorder because they had so much left over last year. I don't know. But I found this and I have seen some other people on YouTube haul this. It is the holographic spider web with like the spiders and the um, moths. And I really like this one. Now this is cute too, but I really like the holographic spider web. I went ahead and bought it even though there's a really good chance that at the end of this season when the stuff goes like 70 and even 90% off, there's a really good chance there might be some left. But I went ahead and bought it just in case there wasn't. It was originally $4.99. So I paid $2.50. And I think that was worth it. I mean, when it comes down to it. And the ribbon, of course, was also 50% off. So I bought two of the candy corn because I'm gonna give one of them away to a friend and some of my Happy Mail. But I really liked the one that says trick or treat. I thought that was really cute. And I really, really love candy corn. So I bought this one. I do have a ribbon that's candy corn, but this one is more of like, it's in the ribbon, like it's in the print of the ribbon. So I thought that was really adorable but yeah I bought two of those um, because I am gonna give one away in happy mail these were originally three dollars a piece so they were each a dollar fifty today and then my last three items are not Halloween related in any way but I just use them a lot um, I am a frequent crafter if you haven't checked out any more of my videos on my channel please go and do that I have a lot of crafty stuff on here um, that's really my passion. I love to craft. I love to swap with my crafty friends. And so I was needing some more glue. And I noticed a lot of YouTubers that are sponsored by Tombow use this kind, this aqua. And I've been having a big issue with me using my glue, kind of messing up my paper. Um, so I thought that I would try out this. I used to have a brand that I really liked and worked really good with my paper. And I bought a new bottle of it and I noticed the consistency was different. So I'm wondering if they changed the formula and I'm just not liking it anymore. So I'm gonna give this a try. Um, it is the Tombow Aqua Mono Liquid Glue. And it's really big. So I think it's gonna last me a long time. And it's got the two tips. It's got like a pin tip and a broad tip. So I thought that was cool. Um, let me know in the comment section below if you use this. Do you like it? Does it work good for you? Does it work good with paper? Because that's my main thing is I work with paper a lot. That's kind of my main craft is paper crafting. Um, so let me know in the comment section below if you've used this and if you like it. And my last two items are just kind of some boring items, but I went ahead and grabbed a, I believe this is, I thought it was a Tombow, but I actually changed my mind about the color I wanted. Okay, so I must've put the Tombow one back. This one is Artist Loft and it's a water-based marker. It does have the two tips. It's got the brush tip and it's also got the other just kind of fine tip. I just needed, um, I have a ton of these already, but I needed this particular color. I needed like a skin color. Um, so, ooh. Is not so I went ahead and bought this just because I needed it and same thing for this one it's just a white gel pen I just was needing a white gel pen so I bought this also okay guys so that is my haul in grand total I paid after taxes I paid $25 and 20 cents 
So I saved $22.54 all together. So yeah. All right, guys, so that is my haul. Thank you so much for sticking with me till the end. As always, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also, if you're not already, please subscribe to my channel. Uh, I post a lot of other haul videos and DIYs, crafty stuff, happy mail. So guys, I hope you have a great day. Bye.